Now, I know that the tour was much more about you guys, uh, much more than just you guys playing your music. Um, and I know there's a, there's a heart of ministry that goes into it. Do you have any stories, anything that uh, stuck out from the tour? There were actually several stories. I mean, yeah. um, it's one of a, a girl who suffered just insane amounts of abuse that I probably shouldn't mention on your show. And just came up and uh, talked about how that night meant a lot to her and um, how her music meant a lot to her. Uh, another uh, girl, uh, we've heard this story so many times, I, I can't believe that it just, you know, it keeps happening, but a person who was going to commit suicide and heard one of our songs and uh, God touched their heart in the middle of listening to the song, gave their life to Christ, decided to live. Wow. It comes to the show. You know, we, so we hear that story. I've heard that story from probably 10 different people. Wow. You know, over our, our over our career, as if it was the same story, but it's not the same story. Right. You know, it's just like God doing this thing. And uh, we never, I never have anything good to say back when someone tells us something like that. I'm, I always feel like an idiot. I'm like, uh-huh, wow. You know, like, that's it? Because what can you say when God just does something so amazing? It's, well, Kevin, you know, it's got to be humbling. I mean, it's got to be... Not to me, because I feel like I didn't have anything to do with it, you know? And so I think that's kind of the, the, the thing that... Um, is really awesome about it that, that why God chooses some of us is because He knows I can't go. Thank you, <laughs> right? <laughs> because well, like I didn't do anything, you know. Yeah, we put that song out into the universe, and then by the time they hear it, and it's this like really pivotal moment in their lives, we're on the bus playing NHL sixteen NHL video games, yeah, or something, we're, you know, doing something do, goofy, yeah, goofing off, and then God's using this, you know, music that we made, but He's the one using it and timing it. And, you know, you guys are facilitating it, and they're listening. So there's so much that goes into it that we don't, you it, know, control. Being in the position that we're in, it's, it's actually enjoyable. We're all sports fans, and so we enjoy, you know, watching games. It's actually enjoyable from a sports fan perspective to watch God's timing with things. <laughs> like, you know, I mean, coming through, you guys wrote a song called At The Right Time, and it really is, you know, like he just does this thing, you know, at the right moment, for these people just over and over again we hear so about it it's, buzzer it's beater. insane he's a, he's a buzzer beater wow <laughs> he is no it's true he is yeah. 